virtualization enables you to run a different operating system on your laptop. It might be other versions of Windows or Android emulators. Multiple virtual machines are formed by dividing the hardware resources such as storage, processors, servers, etc. Virtualization also boosts the execution speed of various emulators. Hardware virtualization is enabled on the majority of modern PCs. However, not all computer vendors have this technology turned on by default when computers are delivered to customers. In today's video, we'll enable this feature in a Lenovo laptop. If you want to enable this feature in HP hardware, click on the I button to check out the simplest process. So let's crack the windows. Let's power on the machine. On the login page, press the shift key and click the power button. Restart it. After restart, you will get the screen like this. Click on Troubleshoot. Advanced Options. Then UEFI Firmware Settings. Now restart to change UEFI Firmware Settings. Machine will enter on Startup Menu instead of Normal Booting. Startup Menu is open and we need to click on BIOS Setup. Now go to Security tab. Here is the Virtualization option. Click it. Depending on your processor, you may find different names here. It might be VT, VTX for Intel processors or AMD V for AMD processors. Just press enter and choose enabled. Same needs to be done for VTD feature. Now press F10 to save the configuration and exit. Click yes. You have successfully enabled hardware virtualization on your Lenovo laptop. Don't forget to subscribe the channel. Goodbye.